Here's a kid who's an inspiration. It's so amazing. He's only nine years old and he has been surfing straight for this entire pandemic. His name is Carter Doraly and he tries to surf every single day, whether it's hot, whether it's cold, rainy, snowy, anything out there. So Bill Rohr, one of our photojournalists, had covered his story where he had surfed 400 days in a row. That's the attempt. Nine-year-old Carter Dorley taught himself how to surf when he was just five. Because it's just fun being out with Mother Nature and having fun. The cold wind had temperatures nearing 30 degrees and water temps just above 40 in Brigantine. But as you can see, that doesn't stop Carter from catching a few waves. Three or at least a few if it's cold. Uh -huh. But if it's like really fun out, then I try to get as many as I can. How cute. And look at that smile on his face. I love that he's got that cap on when you're out in the cold water. Let's get right out to meet him and Jen. <laughs> okay, so of course we sent him out to surf. This is mom. Good morning. Good morning. I said to Carter, I said, did mom take you when it was snowing, when it was cold? And he said, you were the one. I mean, obviously dad too. Mm -hmm. But you've been doing this every single day. What day are we on? 369. Okay, and what day does he want to go to? Uh, every day changes, at least 400, he said, then it's 500, I don't know. Okay, and so he started doing this during quarantine. I talked to him a little bit. You guys live in Brigantine. Yes. Everything that he could do for fun was shut down. Yeah, when the, uh, when the pandemic first started, they shut the hockey courts, um, all that stuff down. So luckily they never shut the beaches down. So um, that was really the only thing he could do. I love it. Okay, so we've told him that we wanted him to surf like he's doing now and then come in. And you've said when you've taken him, you're like, okay, like if it was Tuesday and it was freezing, he'd say, oh, I'm just going to go for one time. Yeah, his and famous keep one going. more, one more, one more. <laughs> How long is he normally out there? Um, he tries to catch at least um, three waves every to count as a session. So. Oh, okay. And, you know, we were joking that, you know, he's on Instagram as Carter catches a wave. Mm -hmm. he's, he does want to get sponsored. Like, he thinks he's going to be the next world champion <laughs> surfer, correct? Um, I don't know what he really thinks, but, I mean, he just loves surfing. And he just, every day, tries to get better and, um, you know. I love it. He has an older brother and a younger brother. Yes. What do they think of the fact that he's been surfing every day? They think he's crazy. Because, yeah. like, it's cold out. Why would you want to be out there? Um, he really is a super sweet guy. You'll forgive me. I'm going to go run up to him, okay? You hold this big thing. He actually listened. I'm so proud of him. By the way, guys, his dad is a firefighter and a lifeguard. So a lot of the times he was the one that was making sure he was safe. Buddy, you look so good. Thanks. Are you chilly? No, it's fine. How are the waves this morning? I'm pretty good. Yeah. So we were talking about it a little bit. Why did you start? Why did you want to start doing this? Because of COVID, there's nothing to do, and I just wanted to have fun. Yeah. Um, do you think you've gotten better every day? Yes. What have you learned in terms of like? Do you have any tips that you could give me if I'm trying to get better? Yes. When you pop up, you want to start from a push up. From there, a cobra pose, and bring you back for a new chest, and just fully stand up. Okay. Uh, who has brought you here more, mom or dad? I think my mom. Yeah. Do you have anything you want to say to her? I mean, she had to like put her puffy coat on, drive you to the beach every day. Thank you. <laughs> That's what I want to say. Um, you want more people surfing, right? Yes. Okay. Well, here's the deal. I'm a really bad surfer. I try it on TV sometimes. It's way too cold for me to surf today, but if you'll let me, I'll come surf with you maybe on your 400th try. Yes. You figure out the day. If it's during the week, we'll do it on TV. Deal? Deal. And you're okay if I'm not good at surfing? Yes, I'm oh. fine. <laughs> really? That, yeah. You're cool with that? Uh-huh. Are you going to bring me a board? Yeah, I have 10. <laughs> 10 boards? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right. Honestly, thank you so much, okay? You're welcome. Anything else you want to try? No. Mm -mm. All right. Okay, I love it. I'm glad that you're not, and be nice to your brothers, okay? Oh. They're probably mad they're not as famous as you. <laughs> All right, do you want to say goodbye to the people on TV? Oh, wait, do you want to say hi to any teachers? Hi. <laughs> he doesn't care. Um, Bye. All right, guess what, Carter? What? Go back in the water. Get Bye. out of here. Run, go, okay. leave. Enough of you. How cool Isn't is he this just, dude? I'm sorry, but nine. he's like the sweetest. He's a, he's a class, he's actually 10. He turned 10 in February. Mm -hmm. Classic middle kid. Definitely. Right? Yeah. That's Does for he sure. like, Take the stuff off 
the floor in his room and put it in the laundry basket? No. Oh, okay. no. Not, not, not even a little. <laughs> okay. Bye, Carter. Say hi to the mermaid. So cute. Doesn't he look like so a merman? Cute. So cute. He's adorable. Imagine him oh. in about five, six years. He's like in his mid-teens. Oh. The I've... coolest dude around. Yeah. Yeah. He already is.